it's time for us to be more serious about our home heating oil needs and other issues that face America as far as energy is concerned. And that means we need to start drilling offshore at advanced oil rigs like this one. This rig survived a hurricane. They have been here for nine years and they have produced a whole lot of oil and natural gas. As we speak, they are producing 10,000 barrels of oil a day and 15 million cubic feet of natural gas. Senator Obama opposed this new drilling. He said it won't solve our problem and that it's, quote, not real. He's wrong and the American people know it. And I hope he'll seize the opportunity to come out and pay a visit like this one. Uh, I think it will probably change his mind. We all want to conserve, but we all know that conservation will not put us, will not be sufficient to put us on the road to energy independence. The nation is sending $700 billion every year overseas to countries that don't like us very much. And when I'm president, that's going to stop. We're going to achieve energy independence, and we're going to buy, do it by using every resource at our disposal to get the job done, including new offshore drilling. New drilling has got to be part of our energy solution. It won't solve this problem alone. Alternative energy will not solve this problem alone. And conservation alone will not. It will require aggressive development of alternative energies like winds, solar, tide, biofuels, natural gas, and it also requires expanding traditional sources of energy like clean coal, nuclear power, and offshore drilling like that done on this rig.